hello what is good so today i'm going to be talking about the trend foil buddha led fountain and all you need is two double a batteries and the river rocks are included but i love this like i came across this and the first thing i thought was that i could use this as a night light the light where it shines is right here and something to help me fall asleep along with you know like positive thoughts this actually helps me this is the last thing that i hear along with the positive thoughts running through my head which it helps it it makes me feel at ease it relaxes me it puts me in a state where i'm calm and just cool and relaxed but it's really not that hard to use and it's not that hard to apply the water in as well which i will show you and what it looks like you know when you're in a dark area but to to drain the water you know after when you apply the water which i'm going to show you in a minute you want to take the rocks all off of the base so it's really easy to apply so it doesn't matter where you put the rocks you know just put it all over the base and you just place it where you want to place it at but remove all the rocks and flip the fountain upside down and the rest of the water the stuff will come out but um to reduce mineral de deposits and bacteria buildup, replace the water every two weeks. I sometimes replace it earlier than, than two weeks, depending on how often I use it, but everybody is different. But you want to do it no longer than every two weeks. So just to make sure that it's working like it's supposed to, that's why you want to add water regularly, especially if you're using it regularly. You don't want to use the fountain without water because it can cause the damage. So, you know, if you leave it out in the sun, I'm pretty sure it can overheat and damage it. Even if you don't have the batteries in it, it will not work properly. Um, like I said before, I use this sometimes to help me fall asleep. The longest that I had this on was for possibly all nine good eight to nine hours. And I didn't use it the next day, but <laughs> it still worked fine. The water pump um, was working. The water still came out. The light was okay. You'll know when you need to change the batteries when the light gets dim and then it doesn't cut on. Um, another thing is, is that there was a time where I left it on for about five hours when I was going to sleep and I turn it off like this does help you fall asleep a lot <laughs> so what you do is that on the side line, right here on the side where you see the opening or any openings around that's where you want to pour the water in you want to pour the water in very slowly the water comes in through this opening right here and then you want to apply the rocks afterwards. So you want to put the water in first and then apply the rocks, you know, anywhere that you want. And what it looks like, you know, when you're in a dark area, it looks like this. See behind it. The different water lines are being separated from each other, which I thought was really cool. And like I said before, you can see the LED light. To activate it, there's a knob, a switch rather, on the back. And you just turn it on. And it comes just like that. And you probably can see it better. And like I said before, the light is right there. And you place the water in this opening right here. You don't want to pour too much water, but use your best judgment and your intuition on how much water you should use. And once you're done, just turn this knob off. And you can leave it like that for a day or two, but me personally, okay, I'm like, okay, I'm not using it. So I 
you know, take off all the rocks and then I flip it upside down. I literally just flip this upside down and everything will come out. But I love this LED fountain. Like I I I really, 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 really love this a lot. Like I thought it was unique and cool. And I love how I was in prayer and meditation position. So go ahead and copy one of these. And I'm telling you, this will definitely help you fall asleep.